when I was a little kid, <clears throat> I used to get scared and um, my mom told me to memorize the verse in the Bible that says, God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. And every time I'd get afraid, I would read, God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. I know everyone is afraid right now, and <clears throat> everyone's getting a little restless staying at home, and I am too. And I'm getting in fights with people over trying to convince them to stay home. But pride goes before destruction in a haughty spirit before fall. So um, that's why I'm going to try to avoid the coronavirus as much as possible or avoid public. Because I do understand the United States is the third worst hit country. And I am from probably the fourth worst hit state. So, I'm nervous. Um, I was thinking about how friends affect who you are so much. Because, um, and, and, and friends can affect your life because of the show um, on my block. Because a little spooky. Everyone seems associated with him, but are, is it that they're associated with him, or is it that they're associated with Ruby? Um, it's it, it's a lot of the show is not spoken, and that's why I actually really do like that show. Um, a lot of it's beneath the surface, but Proverbs says, "Make no friends with those given to anger, and do not associate with hotheads, or you may learn their ways and entangle yourself in a snare." So long time ago I, I wanted to be a comedian and I consulted the wrong person on my comedy and then the only thing they thought was funny was this crude comedy sketch that wasn't but wasn't funny and um, and so I posted it and now I'm like I, I sit around thinking about all the crap I did in the past and that was before I was an internet person and then then I think about the things I did while I was an internet person and it's just like ah but you can't change the past. You can only change the future. And I can't change the way that I made Lizzie feel, or I feel like I, I made it sound like I didn't want her. And I want her to know that I want her because I want her to want me. And I'm not gonna want someone that doesn't want me. It's like, oh, you? I mean, cause that's kind of how I made it sound, but more it was, I fell madly in love with someone else because it was new. And then now I've reached the point that's kind of balanced out where I'm like feeling the same way towards both people. And I don't know. It's going to be okay. It is. It's, it's going to suck. This is going to suck. This does suck. This is, this is really bad because you, you start thinking about, um, how many people could fall ill around the same time and how that could really make it difficult to continue operations, especially if this thing gets out of control. I'm talking about like critical operations like power plants and stuff like that. But that's why we all have to kind of plan ahead. Okay, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna plan for the future. Yeah, our hospitals aren't overwhelmed yet. They will be. Where, where are we gonna put people? Yeah, we don't have to worry about people getting sick at, in these areas. Well, maybe we should be training people to fill their positions if they do get sick. I'm just saying let's, that's because a, a wise child, um, well, that's not what it says. It says wise, wise child um, sows, yeah, both sows and reaps. They don't just put in the work, they also reap. But uh, we need to put in the work now so that we can reap later on.